Hey guys, it's me Krill, and today I'm here with my friend Phantom. What's up? And today we're gonna be opening another one of these tins. This time it's themed around Gen 5. So as always, this is what you get. And here you go, Phantom. Right, so, uh, open these up. if you uh, haven't checked the last video, definitely check it out. It was based around um, Sinnoh Gen 4. Uh, we got some pretty good cards, but I'm not gonna spoil it. Because you could check the video to find out. So, uh, just like the last video though, these are original copies from back in the day. So yeah. So this is Gen 5, but Gen 5 isn't really that, I don't know, I don't really like it much. I know you like it. It was definitely better than a, ugh, Gen 8. Anyway, like every tin, here's a big coin we get. This one definitely looks a lot better than the last one, that's for sure. And here's our card showing the artwork on the front. Looks nice. And it just shows the uh, starter. And here's the placement on this giant uh, artwork. Alrighty. Oh wow. So basically we got the exact uh, artwork again for uh, Darkness Ablaze. And as always we get two generations packs. Just gotta focus. Alright. So, uh, which one you want to do what we did last time? Open this first. Yeah, so open up this one. Uh, it has the same pack artwork. Uh, hopefully, it has good like cards in there. Uh, let's see what we get here. <laughs> so, something I forgot to mention last time was uh, so I said these cards, the cards in these packs were uh, based on the past cards from uh, like old sets. Well, one of them is a uh, base set Charizard, I think. Ugh, so you can't expect what's gonna happen with that. Alright, let me just get a focus. Alright. So we have a Water Energy, a Soul Rock, a Steeny, an Old PC, a Clink, Skiddy. Mm, here, would you care to pronounce this? Oh, you got a Pan Sage? Oh, uh, that's pretty nice. So far, a lot of Gen 5. Oh, more Gen 5, Golette. Oh, wow. um, okay, Vanilla, Carnivine, a Wigglytuff. Oh, that's it? Yep. Oh, I thought there was more. Oh, oh uh, not a Gen 5. Oops. Yeah. Uh, so it's similar to the last video, basically. Yeah, nothing too big. Alright. But these are, the, these are the main hitters right here. Yep. So. We'll try this one first. Hopefully pull either like a base set card or an EX. I, I want an EX. Definitely one of the trainer cards. Those are pretty cool. <laughs> yeah. Let's do this. Alright, so I just open it up. Alright. Okay, again, these only have uh, four cards. Uh, Yep. Oh, all right. So we're starting off with a Dialga, which we got last time. Looks shiny. Ooh. We got a Evelto Gen Six, pretty oh, good. Also, not bad. looks a bit holographic or shiny, as I refer to it. Oh, we got a Trainer Imposter Professor Oak card, all right. which I think was in that fake tin review from oh years ago. Oh, I miss those days. And we got a Surfing Pikachu V. Oh wow. That's cool. Yay, it's based on the old uh, the old artwork when he was thick. Alright. Cool, cool. Not bad. Not bad indeed. Alright, here's our last celebrations pack. Yep. Hopefully we can get more in the future, but these are very hard to come by. Yeah, I, why are they hard to come by? A lot of scalpers. <laughs> lots and lots of scalpers. <laughs> Discord. Alright. Okay. Last pack here. Oh, here we go. Oh, Alright. Uh, Alright. Please focus. Alright, we got a Groudon like last time. Ho oh, oh, like last time. Ooh, this time we got Palkia. And our last one is. Okay, Solgaleo. Oh, good. Ending off with the best generation ever. Oh, thank goodness. So overall. About equal like last time. Not bad, not bad. Mm hmm. So, just to recap, where's the other one? Let's see. Eh, it doesn't matter. Uh, this is what mainly 
Uh, this is the main focus. So we got big highlights. So we're a Soul Galeo and a Surfing Pikachu V. Overall, uh, I don't really recommend buying these tins. They're a bit overpriced. But then again, this, this is like one of the few limited ways to get these cards. So it's up to you if you want to get them or not. But they're pretty fun, I guess. Since you get some cool old artwork. So uh, subscribe to Phantom's channel. Definitely be on the lookout for his videos. Uh, check out Alan's channel. He's a cool dude. And uh, yeah, subscribe to my channel if you want. So anyways, this is Krill signing off.